somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. That's the answer. This is the Appleton Oak. I'm Mason Quinn. Folks, today we are taking a look at 2019's Midsommar. Now, this was a poll winner from all of you out there on Patreon and our YouTube members, and you guys have not steered us wrong before. Uh, this is going to be a first-time watch for yeah. all of us. I had no idea uh, that this came out, but it's A24, and they've gave us some bangers like The Rover, Everything Everywhere All at Once, Good Time. Times, so I'm ready to be blown away. Well, with a track record like that, I'm definitely ready, willing, and able to see what we have in store. Maybe this will be like another Uncut Gems. Who yeah, A A24 always does an amazing job. I uh, haven't seen all their films, but the ones I have seen, love them. I know nothing about this movie. Hadn't even heard of it before we did the poll. Mm -hmm. All I know is that that poster looks extra creepy. <laughs> yeah. All right, without further ado, let's go! Sweden here. Yeah, they give you the creeps right out right off the bat. Yeah. Just the way they're shooting this. Okay, that looks interesting. Well, and the fact that you know it's A24, you just don't know which way they're gonna go. No. Oh, jeez. Well. Got me a little. Hey mom. Hey dad. It's Danny. Listen, I got kind of a scary email from Terry and she hasn't been responding. You know, I'm I'm always here if you need anything. Okay, um, I love you. All right. So people who still sleep through a phone, <laughs> like, oh, my phone rings, I'm, I'm up. It's like there's certain sounds that mm -hmm. just automatically wake you up, you know? Your brain's like hardwired. Yeah. Coming Come to. Oh, no. That's like a very cryptic like, yeah. Facebook post yeah, or message. Hey. Hey, sweetie. What are you up to? You still wanted to hang out later. I should be able to swing by. How's the sister situation? Hey, oh, so, so he knows. knows, yeah. Still no response, so I'm getting a little bit nervous. She oh, does so. this every other day, Danny, and only because you let her. Oh. It's still just another obvious ploy for attention. I'm very lucky to have you. <sighs> yeah, well. He sounds real concerned. Yeah. <laughs> no. I mean, from, but from his standpoint, we, he sees it all the time. Uh, yeah. From somebody who's has experience with this i can tell you after time and time and time and time again we'll talk about it in the wrap-up but i have experience with this sort of stuff you can hear it in his voice he's just working up the nerve to say something what if i'm scaring him off what did your sister write she always does and is tortured and uh, i lean on him constantly is. for support or the only one opening up the only one making yourself vulnerable that's intimacy oh Dude. jesus you don't want her back. I'm right. Hey! What? Our guy! Eyebrows. Um, that's for you. You could be getting that girl pregnant right now. <laughs> don't forget about all the Swedish women. That's not her again. Seriously? She needs a therapist, dude. She has a therapist. Okay, excuse me, guys. Wow. Great. Oh, this call's gonna be bad. Yeah. Well, she had a call from unknown. Danny. Babe. Oh no! Oh, carbon monoxide in oh, the garage. Oh, in the garage. And she passed out. Put it uh, yeah. in drive. And hit then the she wall. do the whole house then for mom and dad, because she said mom and dad were coming with me. Yeah, it's yeah. Two she cars. did both cars. She just ran them. Yeah. They ran the old. Oh, she ran the whole. She piped it into the house. Uh, oh no! That's. Purposeful deletion, I guess, is how I have to Both say it on cars, YouTube. She piped it into the wow. house. That's why they didn't wake up when she was calling on the answering machine. Oh my oh, God! She taped, taped off the, oh, the doors. Of the doors. Oh, she, oh, she did it right to her it, mouth. Taped it to her mouth. Oh, what a man! Jeez. And, like, is he there just kind of going through the motions, or does he genuinely care? Because he was wanting to pull the pin on her, yeah, you know, I the mean, whole relationship anyway. Yeah, I mean, there's definitely relationships where, you know, things happen, and at that time, the the right thing to do, regardless of the relationship status, is to be there for Right. Somebody. Hey, babe. Hey, Danny. How are you feeling? Where are you going? 
I was just gonna go to that party for 45 minutes. No, oh, come with me. So she just lost her whole family. Well, we, we don't know how f much into the future. Yeah, oh, is. that's true. Oh, any occasion or is it just for fun? Research on European midsummer traditions since guys were stagnant a while. Mr. Pals invited us to an authentic hippie midsummer at his yodeling farm. Oh, yeah? Oh, oh she didn't know. I'm thinking about it. For when? To late July? Yeah. Oh. Two weeks from now? <laughs> Two weeks from <laughs> oh. now. We even go. Oh. Go. But, oh, he's trying to get his boys to play along with Yeah. Her. Yep. Yep. She knows. I think if we stopped the movie right here, we could still talk about it for like an hour already. Oh, yeah. You know, easily. I had no idea. I just decided today. I told you I wanted to go to Sweden. No, oh, you said it would be cool to go. I just wish you would have told me, that's all. Well, I just apologized, Danny. Maybe I should just go home. What? No, no. He's trying to... He's trying to end he's it. He's trying to pull the yeah. ripcord so bad. I don't know what my thesis is. It he's, can be inspiring, right? He's going to do it right here. He's going to... Guys, it's Danny. She's coming up. Um, I invited Danny to come to Sweden. Oh! Oh! oh. What? I invited her and she accepted, but she's not actually coming. What is with this guy? I thought you were saying. Yeah, dude, nobody minds. I thought you were saying something else. That's all. So, Sweden. I guess so. That's not completely ruining your guys' plans. Uh, Christian, can I get you to uh, take a look at this paragraph real quick? Uh, yeah. Sure. Oh, well, you might as well bring the laptop with you. If you're yeah. Gonna... Uh, he typed up. Oh, I thought he was going to show him something. Like that he typed, typed yeah. Hey, Hi, Pele. I wonder if he's just going to, like, yell well, the it thing out about, loud. The thing about, like, the, these guys is, like, what do you even say to her? Right. How have you been? Pretty good. Yeah. Survived finals. So. <laughs> uh, I, I didn't I didn't quite finish, but they're they're giving me a, a break this year. Of course. But, Sorry. Yeah. It, uh, uh -huh. how, how did you like the anthropology department? I like it, yeah. Not as much as this one, maybe, but... <laughs> He's looking at his buddy for help. So you're coming to help? Oh, jeez. I guess so, yeah. Crazy nine-day festival my family's doing. Special ceremonies and dressing up. That <laughs> sounds fun. Uh... It's like theater. Yeah, Christian says... That's you're a setup. Stayed back at the time. That's a setup for weird stuff. Yeah. Small. You're from a commune? Mm -hmm. Oh, bro. Well, there might just be a small community. Might be our commune right. and small community. Well, it... Oh wow! Let's see what you mean about the pageantry. Yeah, I mean everybody sort of does everything together. Whoa, who's that one? That's last year's May Queen. <laughs> Beautiful. Why is he looking at her like that? Yeah, creepy uh, vibes from yeah, him. There's... Very good, you're coming. Ah, uh, all right. I was so very sorry to hear about your loss. I lost my parents too, so I. Kind of have some idea. No, I'm sorry. No, you're fine. I'm gonna just go to the bathroom. Thank you. Oh, look at the way they did that shot. Yeah, right oh, into the airplane. airplane. Right into the airport bathroom. That was really cool. Or airplane bathroom. So it's the show she's still having. She's still having anxiety. Right. Oh, well, I mean, obviously attacks. you would, but. Yeah. Oh, landing soon. Oh, we're gonna get turbulence. Oh, that to it. Okay. Oh. How long is the drive? About four hours. Oh Ooh. my god. No. Oh, oh, the they're the doing way they're shot. building the tension with the shot. Oh. With the music. This shot is always money to oh, do. Got to get a creepy. Oh what? what? Look, look at this. that. Be dizzy. I'm not even they're in a Renault. Oh, look at that. Oh. That is so hey, cool. Hey, just pretend you're on like a hanging train or whatever, you know? It's, it's legitimately making me like dizzy. Oak. I'm yeah, sure. Dizzy. I'm sure this all means something to those of you out there who have seen this movie before. Don't but like we're still playing catch up. <laughs> so these are younger people from my village. They're also returning from the trips outside. Let's fucking walk. Yeah, dude. There's so many bugs. You have to. Josh. What? <laughs> Sounded mad. You all you honest now, friends Okay, so there's like a tent out in the field. Meet my brother Ingmar. 
Uh, best friends since we were babies, actually. Yeah. We just took these five minutes ago. Uh, haven't even started coming up yet. Do you guys want to take it now or should we settle in first? Fuck it, let's just take it now, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Don't you have to load an RV first? <laughs> and listen, if you're feeling uneasy, you don't have to take them at all. Guys, I'm going to wait for Danny, so you just go ahead. We can't take them at different times. They'll be totally separate trips. You want to wait for us then? Oh, God. Oh. Is she gonna you know be what? Like, it's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Babe, I'm, babe. I'm, it's, I'm ready. You know, it's weird because in America, and I don't know how it is over there, but like over here, you know, it might be this, you know, considered, you know, recreational activity. I wonder if over there it's more normalized. Mm. So it's almost like, kick, you know, bucking their culture. You yeah. Know, if that makes sense. Are you sure about okay. this? I think it's gonna be fun. <laughs> 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 I'm not okay. Oh, it's a new person. <laughs> <laughs> he just walks by. Oh, I thought I'm he was... just gonna lay down, okay? Yeah, do that. Josh, can you lie down, please? <laughs> <laughs> the energy coming up from the earth. Oh, oh trippy. <laughs> the trees too, they're breathing. Whoa. Nature just knows oh, instinctually how to stay. Okay, I wonder if it. somebody actually were on these watching this scene and just how yeah. You're like my real actual family. Uh, I'm gonna go for a walk. No, 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 no. <sighs> Don't think that you're fine. Oh, does she think it's her family? Well, yeah, the family thing might have got her. <laughs> look at the grass. Well, look at the shed. Yeah, everything. everything. They were laughing at me. What? No, no, no. I'm sure they weren't. Thank you. I'm sorry. Thank you. Oh, oh my God. There was somebody in there. There was. There was. Now there is again. Oh, she's having a bad trip. Oh, uh -oh that's not good. Hey. How long was I asleep? We found you here like six hours ago. Where are we going? Where we came for. Here we go now. Mm. Now it's gonna get gonna get real interesting. Yeah, because now it's gonna get weird as if it's our, <laughs> not completely weird, yeah. normal up to this point. <laughs> Jesus, pal, where are you taking us? <laughs> yeah, this is way the hell out there. Oh, oh look at this. okay. Guys. Yeah, I know. No good. No bueno. Oof. Ah, uh, maybe it'll be okay. This is like giving me like Swedish like Manson vibes, guys. <laughs> like take like the uh Why? They're just they're having a pleasant uh, afternoon in the park. Once upon a time in Hollywood where Brad Pitt rolls out to the uh <laughs> the, the old co like, compound. One of us. It's like Lana. this is like the Swedish version of that. The tranquil and majestic holy god. <sighs> How do you know all these people? These are my family. I mean, they've got a couple of dogs. So and we're goats. stopping in Waco before going to Pell's Village. <laughs> 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 he Thank called you. it out. Uh, he called it out. Have we got any Kool Aid? I was just going to say. I can't believe he said Waco. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what? A little, uh, yeah. little, little on the nose. <laughs> this actually probably shouldn't be laughing about that. Meet my sister, Dagny. Born on the exact same day as me. Born on the exact, exact same, same day. day as me, sister. Mm -hmm. If it was his he, twin, he would have said twin. He said the same thing about his brother, though, too. Born on the exact same day? I thought so. Oh, I didn't catch that. Well, he, said, you know well he said about his brother that they've been friends since they were babies. Babies. Oh, so yeah. they're yeah, all yeah, his yeah. brothers, all his sisters. Okay. Yep. I'm guaranteeing that's what it is. Hello. Hello. Hey. Hello. Hello. Welcome. Welcome. Hell has an immaculate sense for people. I don't know if I a like... sense for people. Just tomorrow, the official ceremony begins, and you are welcome. That guy has a very red face. Yeah. Can you eat these? All right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I want to uh, eat them. I want to eat them. Well, gulp, it's... gulp, gulp <laughs> on the ground. They go. Well, it's just some of their traditional things that they're doing. This might be perfectly normal. Bro, this background music tells me yeah, nothing tells a about different any story. of this is perfectly normal. Which, oh, this is my sister. We were born on the same day. Like, 
Maybe they were reborn. Again, we don't mean to make jokes about everything that happened in Texas, but the fact that we'll, I mean, that's kind of what you think when you see all this, right? Mm -hmm. A lot of new folks, though. A lot of people not in the I'm betting that they all had to bring someone. Something extra creepy is going to happen that these guys are just, they're going to play off as normal, and this crowd's going to be, like, super freaked out. Mm. Something extra creepy is about to happen. I'm excluding the ones who aren't of Swedish Oh, time. they all have something to drink. It has been oh. 90 years since our last great feast. And it will be 90 uh, years before feast? our next. We already have so much to give back. Skål! Skål! Skål, Skål. oh my they're, god. They're just big Vikings fans. <laughs> Whoa. So hög, min el. Inte hetare. What was that? Well, it's like a little finger painting to me is what it looked like. Uh, thanks. Okay. Oh, what was that carved the, on the door? It's the rune, the runes, uh, letters. What's up with the way that roof is? Yeah, the oh, architecture. Okay. Hmm. Hey, Paul, can anyone just join in? Happy birthday. Maybe it's not appropriate. No, 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 not at all. Thank you so much. Kristen forgot anyways. This is amazing. Thank you. No, yeah. no, no, no. I forgot to remind him and it's... it's no, I'm... <laughs> forgot to remind him. What alphabet is that from? Actually, that is the Elder Puthok. How long have you two been together? Oh, jeez. Um... <laughs> Just over three and a half years. Oh! We forgot her birthday. Yeah. Uh, three and a half, four, four years. You're right. I'm sorry. You're right. Mm -hmm. Four years. Uh, I'm not. This dude's not like the Ooh. best. Well, no, he's a he's a total coward that should have broke up with her, and he wasn't into her, but he won't do it. Yeah, the gaslighting. No. What's that <laughs> building over there? It's uh, like a sacred temple, but no one's allowed in there. Okay, so she. Uh, I ain't putting that one together. I got no idea. I I'm lost. Wow. Oh, man. It's like another world. <laughs> Amazing. Not a lot of privacy. Yeah, what do you do when you need to jerk off? <laughs> <laughs> she says something. No, 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 absolutely not. I just wanted to let you know. Oh. Oh, so he gave her a heads up about yep, the birthday. birthday. Barna sitter nere och kollar på Austin Powers som ni nere i... Hell, who was that? Yeah. Oh my god, I want to give her a bath. <laughs> Can I pull you on the time? <laughs> yeah. Uh, bro, you can't make it too obvious when he was just talking to yeah. you. Uh, he's he's terrible. What has he got? What is that? Happy birthday. Oh my. Uh, you. She knows. She she has to. Yeah. Why won't the candle light? I'm sorry, I got up by the daylight i thought it was yesterday happy birthday oh look at the background over there by the yellow pyramid oh well polter's gonna have some words about the crying baby yes yes he will oh uh, why are you putting a scissors underneath the pillow hmm. what's tomorrow first of the big ceremonies at the stoop bump. uh it's too hard to explain you'll, you'll get a better sense tomorrow i mean it's pretty actual Nah, no service. Do you know what it is? Dude. Is it scary? Okay. Oh, that's not good. Cutting their arms. Hi. Doing some laundry. It's the same song from the beginning. Yeah. Day one of yeah, the, the feast. The camera shots are just so awesome how they do this. Yeah, they really. I think they, the way they shoot this just makes you super uneasy like the whole time. Mm. Yeah. You're waiting for something to happen. Why are they walking backwards to do it? Hey. Oh. Br look at bro on the right. Yeah. They're, Something bad. Their, their faces are telling a story. <clears throat> oh, okay, they all got food in front of them, though. They look like they might be 72. Oh, I wonder if that's what it is. They are 72, and this is some sort of... 
Well, you know, the one guy knew what it was, but he's not saying anything. Yeah. Now I feel like I should be quiet. <laughs> you know, it's, it's weird. <laughs> she doesn't look 72, though. Well, it's not the age, it's the mileage. Mm, don't like the way those tables are laid out either. It's, like, like, big like runes, it's another table. big rune stone. <laughs> He's uh, like, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, guys. Uh-uh. Okay, she could be 72. Yeah. What? What? A timer. I think they're just going to tip over. Oh, God. <laughs> You're so worried. I think it's going to be fine. No, everything. <laughs> this is creepy as fuck, <laughs> man. This weirds me out, dude. <laughs> <sighs> that guy seemed to be smiling even yeah, when they got Yeah, they've up. had a lot of different facial expressions on different people's faces. You know, like, that dude doesn't look too happy, probably because he's almost 72. Uh. Oh. What, what oh. a Lion King is this? Oh, are they going to, they're going to walk off. Oh. Yeah. God, is that a, uh, help us out in the comments. Is that a real, like, obviously, obviously, is it a set or is this real scenery, like a place in Sweden? Well, he, our guy here, he yeah, totally would, knows what's going to happen. Why would this guy tell the other people what's happening? Like, why, well, why was he smiling about it, yeah. too? Well, maybe it's a culture thing. What is that book? It will be that our scripture. Can I read that? You will not be able. I mean, I guess if this is a cultural thing, I shouldn't be as creeped out by <laughs> it, you know? Just respect their culture. Oh, remember like in the picture? Ooh, is that a Mora? Oh, she is gonna she's gonna lose it. Oh, the well, there's a rock below where they're yeah, gonna fall and hit the rock. The music. Oh, he's here. just watching them. But if why would you bring your college friends to something like this? I mean, so they need more members. Even if it's cultural, like the like how traumatic it could be from somebody from outside your culture. <gasps> oh! 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 oh my gosh! Oh! See the face? It was. Yeah, dude, we saw it. Oh. Oh, oh, could have done without that. Oh, he's going to go too. Here he yeah. Comes. Oh, my God. It's interesting the camera shot on her, though. Like, what's going through her mind? No! Oh! 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 Oh, he made it. No. Oh, I was gonna say, don't show oh. the legs. He's still alive. What's going on? Why do oh, they have those big the hammers? hammers? That's what the hammers for. Finish the job. Oh. oh. Are they all gonna do it? Oh. Oh my God. Oh. All right. I don't think he thought it was gonna be like that. <laughs> Uh, listen, Whoa. let me explain. Whoa. Great joy for them. Uh, joy? Yes, and when it's my turn, it would be a great joy for me. Instead of getting old and dying in pain and fear and shame. I'm Looking right so at her. I didn't warn you better. Warn you better? You didn't say you anything. You probably didn't warn him at all. No. Where's Will Poulter? Yeah, um, I think he was... I think he was with that girl I think he was giving the up. eyes to. Yeah, so he missed it this was... whole thing. She going towards that building? Like her? Oh my god! I'm trying to be understanding, like if this is their culture or their custom, and that's how you are raised from birth. Right, you wouldn't know until any different. that age, and you saw it yeah. as the end of a life cycle, as mm -hmm. they do. It's hard to argue with their cultural beliefs. Mm -hmm. He's typing about it. Yeah, yeah. He knew about he it. He knew hey, how listen, it was gonna I'm, go. I've been thinking a lot about my thesis. I've decided I'm going to do it here on Horga. Is that what he's I doing? His I feel like I can't tell if you're joking. You know that what you're doing is unethical and leechy. This is not some glorified hobby that I'm casually dipping my feet into. I'm going to do my thesis here. 
Uh, Christian, always looking for the easy way out. I seriously doubt that the elders will approve of anything being written down. Just use aliases for everything. Problem solved. Then what would be the <gasps> point? You couldn't even get it peer reviewed. Oh. oh. He wants to tell the story of what's going on here, but you can't get it peer reviewed anywhere mm. because there's no actual information right. about yep. what goes on there. Yeah, you're not using real names and stuff. Thank you for inviting me, but I, I really have to go. I know it looks extreme, but we I don't only... know why I'm here, Pele. I invited my friends because this is a once-in-a-lifetime thing, and I wanted to share it. Calls you down. No, I'm fine. I don't want... I, I lost my parents my when I was a little boy. They burned up in a fire. But I have always felt held by a family, which is... everyone deserves. Is he trying to convert her? Yeah, totally. So He figured she would be the easiest one because she's technically an orphan i guarantee he's my good friend and i like him but pele told christian to invite her but don't tell the other guys yep see does he feel like home to you nope i mean danny's hey. got to put it together with christian are you, doing? are you not disturbed by what we just saw yeah of course i am <laughs> no, <laughs> oh my god this guy is so phony it's cultural you know Do you have a sleeping pill I can take? Yeah, sure. I still want to know why they put the scissors under the baby's, the baby's pillow. pillow. Yeah. Is everybody out except for her? Is she going to be the, the new queen of the uh, season? They're all leaving. They're bailing. They got all their stuff. This has got to be a dream sequence. Yeah, I mean, she did take a sleeping pill, so. Or is it not a dream sequence? Oh, no. She's seeing the... The flashing lights again. Yeah. And the smoke. Yeah, the smoke. Man, what is with her? Oh, did he see? Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Was she trying to mark him or something? something? You know, there's still a bear in a cage. Yeah, we didn't get any explanation yeah. for that. Drop a, is that a, I don't know if that's some sort of cultural thing or. See, he's video recording all of it. Any word? Yeah, they say you can do it. As long as you absolutely don't use any names and you're splitting it with Christian because he came to me first. Do you know what this is? Cast a love spell. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Well, I think my sister Maya is taking a liking to you. And actually, she just uh, got Big Smindig last year. Uh, you were you're allowed to have sex. Pants license. <laughs> Pants license? Is he peeing on the You pissed on the ancestral tree. That tree is tied to all of our dead. It's a dead tree, though. I just had to pee. I didn't know it was special. Oh, that is not boy. good. All right, where's, uh, was it Simon? It was really nice to meet you. I'm so sorry. We're, we're actually leaving. Uh, Simon, uh, he told me to tell you. John drove him to the train station, and after uh, Simon gets dropped off, he's sending the truck back for you. The train station. Yeah. Simon left without Connie. Jesus, really? Yeah. On the, on the subject of couples, actually. Um... God, this guy... So he Sorry, just ignored I mean, you know, that. Small communities. Yeah. So uh, the elders must approve mates. So we often yeah. need to invite outside people. That's why she was putting the love rune on his bed. Would you like to help join us? Sure. Yeah. Cool. What are we making here? Meat tarts. You guys watch Yellowstone at all? Uh-uh. Oh, well, then they won't get the reference. <laughs> yeah. Anybody who watches Yellowstone will get what I'm talking about. Oh, thank you. Um, she, she's so beautiful. Oh, she's oh, in love I with can... her boyfriend. She doesn't yeah. like him. Each runic letter stands for one of the 16 effects. This one, for example, is about grief. The ruby, rather, is a work forever in progress. Uh, this iteration is being written by Ruben. The disabled. Since birth. It's the guy we saw. Do you think it's from inbreeding? Probably. What happens when Reuben dies? Uh, Reuben was a product of inbreeding. Mm. Can I take a photograph? Absolutely not. Okay, sorry. Absolutely not. Oh boy. Uh, was that Connie? 
Yeah, I'm I'm thinking so. Oh, yep, that's her. Det är dags för mat. Thanks. Fuck. Thanks. Why do they keep looking back at his? Has anyone seen Connie? No, she was screaming earlier. Yeah. <laughs> Her boyfriend called the landline from the train station and calmed Connie down. That's really. Why would Simon leave without her? I'm sure it was just a miscommunication. No, you're just a miscommunication. <laughs> I could see you possibly doing that. Ah! Oh! oh! So much so sore about their ancestral tree. Ah! <laughs> oh, just giving them the look. Ooh, her oh hair. God, dude, what the? F Is that a pube? Ew. Oh, the, the, remember the, the thing, the, the painting, yeah, the pictures. Then, the, oh, and that's his is oh, that, right that's out. what's in there. Yep. Uh, the, 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 oh, yeah. yep. <laughs> you come with me. Uh, I'll show you. Okay, I'll be back. I guess she's gonna show me. What? Uh, show me yeah. what? Um, come on. What if the other guy who's eyeing him up is like her partner? But they need to bring in somebody Some else. New bloodline, yeah. For a different bloodline. Oh, like he's putting stuff together. He's not telling us. <laughs> he's sleeping with his shoes on so he can run. I mean, just start walking, man. You'll get there eventually. Is he not going to bail? He wants to go look for stuff. He wants to take oh, pictures of that book. Yeah. Oh, bro, he's going to get busted. He's going to get pictures. He's going to get eighty-six like the other two. God, the settings for this are just insane. So I'm, I have a feeling that's like a two-way mirror. Yeah. Oh, oh there's no. somebody coming. Oh, he's finished. What the f Mark. Is he bleeding? No, I think he's... Oh! 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 That's a skin Someone mask. in his That is face. a mask. That's Will Poulter's skin. Yep. The 19th book of Ruby Rotter was found missing. We kindly ask that whoever took it to return it. Nobody need to know. They're setting them up so they think Mark took it and, and bailed. The other guy took it and yeah. bailed. They both disappear the same day. We are in the dark on this. We're just as confused as you are. You and Odd, you can go looking for them. Yes. You are going with the women for the day's activity and uh, Sieb. Wants to see you in her house. Oh boy. What is that? I mean, it's. Uh, is it some sort of fertility yeah, tea? Or ceremony, yeah. Can I ask what this is exactly? Tea for the competition. Glass here? Mm -hmm. And then we drink it? <laughs> okay? Okay. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> Oh, look at that. They gave her the, it's the, uh, the acid again. Yeah, the, the tea. Or the shrooms or whatever, the Shroom mushroom tea. tea. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. they gave it to her again. Or maybe uh, they all have it. I think they all, have, they it, all have it. But, but here's the question. Have the other girls built up some sort of tolerance to it? Mm -hmm. Or... Som den mörkerdurade ut horgasonom i gräset. Och när de väl hade börjat dansa så kunde de inte sluta. I livsbejakande trots mot en mörk. The dance winners. Oh my oh. god. Kommer att krönas på First stamina. Utgård. Oh, my quads are already burning. Jesus, <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, they're going to burn the bear. That's why they have the bear. They're going to set him on fire. Please, come in. Well, that's not creepy at all. You have been approved to mate with her. You're an ideal astrological match. Look at her getting all into it. It's the most fun she's had all week. Yeah, it's the first time we've really seen her smile. Are you ready? You'll be doing. You'll see. Oh my god. Whoa. Oof. They probably do all sorts of different dances to make them dizzy and yeah. look at how much they're spinning. A lot of spinning. So they spun in circles. Now they're doing this. Oh, boy. Eight! Eight! We're what? eight left! <laughs> For you? Oh. It's the acid tea. Yeah, they're going to get him tea. all messed up. I'm worried I'll have a bad trip. Oh, no, no. You won't. Oh, okay. I didn't think you would. Oh, look at the brother. Yeah, it was right. He did it. Yeah, right there. Yeah, no, no. 
What? There's your winner. We have fought for my drottning. You are our May Queen. The May Queen. Oh, man. Oh, it's mom. Oh, wow. May Queen. Oh, that's who he wanted. What's the May Queen mean, though? Oh, it's all still trippy. Yeah. Did, what, remember he was just looking at the table and it looked empty? Yeah. Herring? It's tradition for good luck. Ugh. Herring. Uh, ah! Oh. 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 oh, he's having a bad trip. You are the family now. Yes? Yes, you are the stuff is still moving. Yeah. I can't tell if he's going to leave or throw up. Oh, he's still there. The queen must ride alone. <laughs> he's in no condition. Yeah. It's interesting. They bring her off. So now... If she they, can't see him leaving yeah, to go with her. Do something to him. And he knows that she doesn't see him leave either. What, what is that? Uh, oh, okay. Sad half day. Sad half day. Oh, his pupils are pretty, uh, yeah. pretty dilated. Oh, no. For your vitality. You guys, you guys are crazy. <laughs> the old school. <laughs> yeah, I know. If somebody was expecting me to, wow, this oh. is this is what what would get me worked up is this guy wearing he, that. Yeah. yeah. He is still tripping out. This is like the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Definitely different. Yeah. <laughs> what the? <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Uh, this is not wearing the uh, face anymore. What's that? That's not for us. Oh, wow, I'm surprised boy. she let her go. Oh, boy. Awkward. Maybe they let her see it on purpose. That's uh, why they. Why would they have pulled the cart right up there? Right, right. If they were trying to really hide it. Uh, All breathing with her. Uh, oh god, uh, it'd be even creepier. So me. bizarre. Oh, there's our guy. Yep. Is it gonna be his two guys? Oh, oh, there's Simon. That's Simon, yeah. Oh, was the leg his girl's leg? No, the leg was of uh, Josh. Oh, yeah. Josh. Yeah. Like, I, I saw it. You could tell it was darker. Yeah, yeah it had hair. I think he's done, too. Yeah. Oh, that yeah. was. They got what they needed from him. That. You can't speak. You can't move. Oh, no. Oh, no. The day of our deity of reciprocity. What did they do to him? We will today surrender nine human lives. For every new blood sacrificed, we will dedicate one of our own. And one to be chosen by the queen. What's this, bingo? It's not like she really chose no. it. No. <laughs> she did not. Honorable Torbjorn, please step forward. Didn't they have five new bloods? Him, Christian, Mark, Hughes. Josh, and the two others? Oh, wait, the other guy the, was still alive. Yeah, but then yeah. there's four of the other ones. Oh, they already have the new blood. I see. So they already have the four, and mm -hmm. now she's got to pick between another new blood. Yep. And they want her to pick him. 
And then if she 86 is him, then other bro can step in and. Yep. Uh, hey, yep, yeah, that's just straw a... puppet. Oh, there's the bear. Oh, boy. Are they going to put him put inside, him in inside of it? Oh, my God. Oh, they did make him fit. Tall for me to get on them. Oh, so they built that whole just, place. Just to torch especially it. Especially for this. Yeah. Oh, she's got a watch. Gosh. Ah. Oh, this didn't work. S oh, no. So much for no pain. She had that dream about breathing in and out dark smoke. Yeah. Sound like a fire truck a little bit to you guys? They had a siren in there for a minute. I thought maybe she was imagining, oh, you know, from, from okay. her experience. What's she so happy about? Oh, come on. Seriously? There's no way that's the ending. That appears. Wow. <laughs> oh, jeez. What did we just watch? What was this? Unbelievable, guys. I'm... Uh, I, I, I just, I don't know. <laughs> I... Oh, I thought you were maybe still searching for something. No. I got... No um, idea where to begin with this one, but I'm going to give it a shot. First off, uh, I guess thanks to all you out there on Patreon and YouTube members who, who voted this one in the poll for us to check out and watch. And I can imagine from your point of view, the whole time you're just watching like, oh, these guys, it's just they're, they're not going to put it together till like the very end. And that's pretty much the way they wrote the story. Uh, the look of confusion across my face for pretty much the whole movie I think stayed there but it was interesting when it started out because like all the characters and I don't know if it made the cut or not there's obviously a ton to go through here but all the characters were essentially all being really fake and lying to each other and nobody was genuine uh Christian didn't want to be in a relationship with Danny but he was in it for you know four years and two weeks apparently and like all his buddies are like man like what are you doing four years in two weeks yeah that's why I said four years and two weeks and all his buddies are like man what are you doing you don't, you don't even like the girl like what's going on and you know Will uh Poltier did uh, he, he did an admiral job of adding some levity and a little bit of humor to it, but after a while, it just got to a point where you're like, what is going on? But again, it was very interesting how disingenuous everyone was with everybody in the beginning. And I look, I can't begin to break down if that had some kind of deeper or further meaning in the film as it went on. But you know, a 24 gives people a lot of freedom to do pretty much whatever they want with movies. And we certainly saw that, uh, with this, you know, the start hooked you right away with a hugely traumatic event going on. And then, you had two people, Danny and Christian, who were like just not meant to be together at all. Like Danny was, you know, very dependent and blaming herself when Christian would start to pull away or say something. And he just wouldn't, you know, he just wouldn't end the relationship despite how unhappy he was. And then, uh, Pele threw me off uh, in the beginning. I didn't expect him to be all of a sudden the whole ringleader of everything and having an ulterior motive to make Danny the May Queen. And and who knows what that means? I don't know if that he's can eventually get with her. And I don't know if they have husbands and wives in this setting. But it was just it was, brothers it, and sisters. Yeah, it was it was funny because we're going on. We're like, well, or the, I mean, I was, I was having a little bit of fun with it. But I'm like, oh come on, Oak, let's not be too judgmental here off the start. Maybe it's maybe it's different cultures. And that's just what they do but obviously made the huge left turn uh there in like the last uh, i don't know what it is probably 40 45 minutes or so where you know clearly some some crazy stuff going on so yeah, sir, can you I, scroll back up to critical results yeah so i don't even here. i don't even know where you where you begin with this it's it's something where i like i said in in that first uh 10, 15, 20 minutes of the movie, I thought we could sit and talk about that whole scene for about an yeah. hour and how that affects people. And then it just, this total bizarre world of, I'm just going to call it a cult so we can just use that to describe it 
because it's easy. Uh, I don't know what else you would call it, but completely bizarre, all sorts of weird traditions. And, you know, it kind of had that feel of like, oh, yeah, you can you can leave anytime you want. A mm. Anytime you want to leave, you can. No. Sure. no oh, except can't. the truck's broken down or this happened or that happened. So. I don't know. We already took him to the train station. Yeah, we'll be right back. Completely bizarre. I came to expect nothing less from a24 so this was this was something else that's about all i can say <laughs> all right yeah it's it's <laughs> i i i don't even know where to begin it's yeah this one person said it's a perverse breakup movie yeah that's uh, totally what it she is she was happy at the end she had a smile she, well she was also happy dancing when she was high on shrooms that's so true. you you don't know what it was I, yeah they didn't belong together it just something happened bad they were together for you know almost four years he forgot her birthday there's no reason they should have been together yeah. but this is an extreme case of breaking up yeah and, and he did a very good job of like just showing like a kind of lukewarm effort of doing oh, like the anything. boyfriend stuff that, oh, was, anything. that was well and, done and even when we saw after the party we thought that that was donzo so we were waiting to see where this movie's going totally different atmosphere as soon as we, he was showing the pictures of like oh this is our stuff in the white robes and this white stuff i was like this isn't gonna be good. I I had a strong feeling it wasn't be good, and I gotta say I was right. <laughs> and the thing, I mean, it wasn't bad per se, but I do gotta say is it moved really slow. They could have easily trimmed a lot of fat on this. They didn't have to show every little second of every little step of every little movement that they made. Yeah, almost, that was starting to really get to me. Yeah. Like it's like, all right, let's see what's going on here. Like the scene they had in the barn with you know, you know the party scene. It's like, all right, come on, let's go. <laughs> come on. I mean, seriously, uh, it just. It, I don't know. I it wasn't bad per se, but it could have moved a lot faster. Um. But I do not want to take anything away because Florence Pugh's acting in this was just simply amazing. Mm -hmm. I mean, she is an amazing actress. You know, she's an Oppenheimer that will that eventually we'll get to. She was, you know, Black Widow was. She was Scarlett Johansson's sister in oh, it. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't so, recognize her from anything. Yeah. So like, she is an amazing actress and she crushed it in this role. But aside from that, like, yeah. uh, and it's just so it was so weird and just. I didn't know where they were going with this. I, I understood it was a cult, but like we saw an old man jump off the cliff, and, and an old woman jump off the cliff. Then they 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 par they essentially paralyzed him and put him into a bear, and then they set everybody on fire at the end. I, I whatever. It, I mean, I just caught a line there. It says it's Swedish folk horror. So if if anybody in the comments knows, okay, if this guys, is like an old like story, like a, like a Hansel and Gretel, yeah, would be is, 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 is this you know, you know is like this that. a tall tale that you guys right. would tell? Them? your kids not to go <laughs> don't go know. wandering in the woods in northern sweden uh so yeah oh, <laughs> oakish oakenshire man, man who's well here's gonna bring us home here's here's <laughs> what i know we're reactors we react to movies mm -hmm. and people seemingly enjoy seeing us react to movies and our responses <laughs> and i'm guessing this recommendation was it's people are like oh this movie's really messed up. Yeah. We want to see these guys watch this. Um, you know, it, it's interesting going through the critical response. Um, somebody said more unsettling than frightening, which is true. It's kind of like a like a WTF, just over and over. Like, yeah. What the? What the? What the? I mean, like, it's not. Um, we should have a counter for how many times you said so what's going it's not on. Like here. a jump out. So scare there's not. You. There's not really yeah. a lot of jump scares. Yeah. And. Uh, you know, the, some of the scenes were incredibly graphic. Uh, the people coming off the cliff was as graphic as I think anything you'll ever see. Um, the young man hanging in the chicken coop. Um, so incredibly graphic, but none of it was scary, if if I can say that. It's just disturbing, it's just creepy. Man. Now we we um, we're writing for Variety, which we we really love, or at least I, I know, and I think these guys will speak for us as well as Diamond Dave. We love everything Variety does, but one of Variety's writers. Uh, Andrew Barker noted that it is neither the masterpiece nor the disaster that the film's most vocal viewers are bound to claim. And I can really appreciate Andrew Barker's comment there because I think people who really dig this like Swedish like folklore mm -hmm. pagan type movie are going to be like, oh, it was awesome. 
And I think the people who really hate it, like, you know, like, like, you know, I, I'm not, I'm not saying answer says he hated it, but it was like, okay, like, yeah. you know, the, the scene where we were waiting for Christian to go off to the barn for me was like, okay, yep, he's messed up at the table. Yeah, we get it. Like he's messed up. Yeah, we don't know what's going on. And then, you know, they brought um, Danny away. And then they rolled out the flowers and stuff. Um, it's almost as if they wanted you to be there. I think they just. Know? I think the directors were like, <laughs> "Let's just make people uncomfortable the entire mm. movie." No, I, I don't want to pe- leave people hanging. So if you were watching the the beginning and you're still here, uh, I said I can relate to Danny. I have um, I have fam. I'm just going to leave it at family. I have family, um, uh, a family member who's who's who, who's pretty severely bipolar. And um, now in, in 2023, I think medication is pretty good on handling that, although there's still a lot of issues that people deal with. Um, so the the reference of it's there's there's always something where you're trying to get attention and trying to get that. Uh, I've lived that and I've experienced that. And so in very, very personally. Um, so. I didn't want to come across as insensitive in the mm-hmm. beginning to what her sister was saying. Right. But sometimes people who are in those situations, um, when they're when they're going through, um, you know, you know, certain things, they'll they'll repeatedly say things like that, whether they mean them or not. Obviously, in in this case, they meant them. But it does, uh, and like I said, I'm just I'm not going to get into it too much. This is this is more than enough. But I'm saying from a very personal experience, it does get to be a lot like the boy who cried wolf. Yeah, well, and it was... Look, nobody... Look, you can have your own... You, you, Nope. This is the one time where I'm going to say nobody can tell me anything on this one. Uh, Like I said, I'm not going to get into it any more than that. Nobody can criticize me on this. I I lived it very, very personally. So... Um, not me, but I lived it. So it, I didn't mean to come across as insensitive, but again, you do very much get the boy who cried wolf sometimes with that behavior. Unfortunately, in these circumstances, um, you know, something terrible happened. Now I will follow up with that, um, that, uh, if you do, if you, if you're in that situation where you're having those thoughts or you do have friends who are family, I, I understand, but you have to get them help. Like we have right. to get them help, but you can't ever, uh, I sympathize, but you can't ever for as many times as it happens, you have to kind of, you have to be Danny and you can never just let it be the boy who cried wolf because you never know when it's going to happen. So while I'm saying I relate and I was kind of like, okay, I've been there at the same time. And I know we don't need to turn this into a big PSA, but if you're struggling from those thoughts or somebody else's don't ever never settle for the boy who cried wolf because you don't know when a situation is like this is going to happen. Um, in any regard, um, <clears throat> you know, Christian, they, they made you. Yeah, what they did made you think you, about their relationship. They made well, they made you they not like care it. about Christian. That's what they did. Right. Mm-hmm. He was, um, you know, in, in the beginning. Um, I I don't know if I think as much coward as Quinn. You know, I'm not going to say that. Like initially, um, like right away, because look, we've all been in relationships where they start to fizzle out. And you want to break up. You don't know the right moment, whatever. And then if you've been in a relationship where like, um, you know, something bad happens. You know, I was in a relationship when I was younger where it was a lot like it was on and off and things were whatever. And she got in a car accident, like not a bad car accident, but enough where she was in the ER and it was scary, you know, and you, you just take everything and it kind of like puts you in this, like, okay, I have to care for this person mm-hmm. mode. Um, the, the the gaslighting when she was like you know you you never mentioned going well I said I wanted to go like that that bothered yeah. me um, and then it worked too because she's if like I'm, oh, if, I'm sorry. And if I look I'm, if I'm being completely transparent a lot of is you know I'd like to think I'm more mature now but I would be completely lying if I said I hadn't done that in past situations when you're younger sometimes as a guy. I'm sure it's the same for girls. You get caught in certain situations. You don't want to accept blame for your wrongdoing. And so you can call it gaslighting. You can call it blame shifting. You can call it turning it around. Look, we've, we've, uh, I'm not going to say we've all done that. I don't want to take my errors and put it out there, but that's what he was doing. So that was also relatable. 
but they made you just not like the guy from the right. get-go. So you were invested in Danny because you felt bad. You knew she was uncomfortable. Will Poulter's character, you know, he just wanted to have a good time. Mm -hmm. So you you did feel bad about him. Um, you know, I, I got to be honest, like Josh's character, like the fact that he was there, they did accept him. Yeah, and they, they and, and look, whether they had plans to, you know, kind of put him up for the sacrifice, which it feels like maybe they did right from the get go or, you know, but the fact that he went and was taking the pictures and completely disrespected after he was told over and over, like, you can't do this. Maybe that's like, what did they made you. Yeah. So I, I think what they did is like, they make you feel like this is really messed up. This, 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 um, I'm just going to call it a cult. Cause let, look, right, that's not, the easiest let's way just, to just, let's get just call it, it what yeah. it is. Right. Yeah. I'm going to call it a cult. You know, you, you, they, they, they make you have mixed emotions about them too, because culturally speaking and the way the lady yeah. explained it at 72, right. like, I don't look, I don't agree with that. Like my dad passed when he was 76 and it was like, th th you know, at grandkids games, he was sharp as a tack, you know, other than um, his accident, he was in, in, in pretty good health and he loved his grandkids and doing stuff. And so the, the, you know, in, in, you know, I had a great uncle who lived till he was 96 and he was hanging out and like having mm -hmm. chats and, and good times. And so the, the notion that when somebody's 72, like, that's... like, like that's it, um, that is crazy to me. But on the same time, you want to respect other people's cultures. And that was like the weird thing. Like at the beginning, it's like, this is okay. This is weird, but let's respect their culture. Their cultures are different. Mm -hmm. Then when you realize that they're taking unwilling participants people who had right. no idea what they're getting into and forcing them into all this stuff against their will completely against their will and then murdering people then you're like okay this isn't just a cultural thing this is a straight up cult um if i have to pick apart the the, the movie like i i agree with answer that they really really yeah. dragged out yeah. a lot of parts if i have to guess look we know a24 is great I'm guessing they drug it out because the longer they drag it out, the more uncomfortable it gets. And we saw that in the scene when he was impregnating the girl, yeah. the party scene. Um, it, it got weird and uncomfortable. And I think that's why they drag yes. some of this stuff out. It makes you uncomfortable. Um, but I, like at the end of it, it's like I'm thinking like, and, and maybe it's like too practical, but I'm thinking like, okay, you have now four missing American college students yep. um, who were going over to Sweden. They have the plane tickets. They probably had some sort of itinerary. They probably had text messages and chats with uh, with uh, with Pele. Well, and especially Josh, because um, he was studying that in yeah, particular. Yeah, Josh that was, was, Josh was thesis. Yeah. And they looked like they showed Josh on his cell phone. Uh, I do see one part where they said no service. Right. But yeah, he was just taking pictures. But yeah. even if there was any service at any point, you'd be able to ping his cell phone. So part of he's like, yeah, they're, yeah, they're probably going to get away. They're going to get one. caught. I know that's in hindsight. Yeah, um, but all in all, oh yeah, they said they only do this once every what hundred years or 90, something. Well, that was that was the other thing that threw me years, off is yeah. that the people who are seventy two every time they turn seventy two do they whatever? But they need to get that. That was another thing, and, and I'll wrap it up here. That and I'm glad Answer brought it up. That did throw me off too because like we do this every ninety years. But you need to bring new people in to help, you know, yeah. with the, the inbreeding issues. But people in your new people are turning 72. So I don't know either. I missed it or I don't know about you well, guys. I think with the 72 was just to signify that's when their life ends and they give the name. To right. The but they were saying, more. but they were saying this, we only do this every 90 years. But so. it's not. But he said no, that no, no. they don't always do the inbreeding. That was, they try to get away from them. They oh. separated the bloodlines. Uh, yeah. It but just, they, and the inbreeding and was for have. writing the Raja. But uh, yeah, right. they, said that, yeah. they said that everyone has four, four seasons of life. Yeah. Yep. Oh, I, yep. That I got. I just yep. was like, when so it's zero to 18, 18, 18 yeah. 36, 36. So but in any regard, unsettle, unsettling, unsettling is, yeah. is a great term for the movie. I'm curious to see what you guys think <laughs> yeah. as far as a score. I'm, oh, I'll start off. Okay. Uh, way too slow paced. Not for me. I'm giving it a two. Yeah. Um, Florence, Florence Pugh, though, five. The acting was really good, though, in this all around. But yeah, sorry. Yeah. So it's, I just didn't think it was that great. Yeah, I mean, for me, I'm going to go ahead and give this a three. Uh, not my favorite A24 movie that I've seen so far by any means. Like Answer said, I did felt it dragged a little bit. Um, I think if you're 
a fan of this type of movie and you're maybe interested in something like that, you know, maybe it's like a true crime thing you might be interested in and you're into exploring like cults and things like that. Uh, maybe you might find uh, a level of interest there, but for me, uh, a little bit slow. I thought the details were great. The sets were awesome. The acting was amazing. The little stuff they did, like everybody in the background having different facial features and expressions, I thought was really good. But you know, beyond that, the story just, it, it, it wasn't very surprising, right? Like it was an A24 film. They were going to the strange place. People were acting weird right off the start. I had a feeling they weren't making it out. And that's kind of the vibe that I got right, right away. Yeah. Uh, didn't really love it. 2.5 for me. One of the lower scores that I think I've given uh, on this channel. I, um, I just, for me, look for me. And I know, I know I'm going to get roasted for this, but four college kids, the four unwilling and the two kids from London, you have six people. I don't care if you're out in the middle of nowhere in Sweden. I don't know what cell phone reception looks like there. They all probably had plans. If you're college kids in America, if you're going to Sweden for a month, which they had planned, you probably told your family, your friends back mm -hmm. home where you were going, you had cell phones, you could ping it. The notion that this would just fly and like they go on with their lives. It's like, okay, can I get a follow up on the investigation on this? You know what they should do is they should do a true Detectives, <laughs> seen it. A true detectives with Matthew McConaughey I haven't, I haven't and Woody seen Harrelson haven't seen investigating it. this. Yeah. That would be good. That would be pretty um, good. I, I, my biggest criticism go, is that, again. and I, I agree with the answer. I think answer nailed it. I understand that they probably did it to make you uncomfortable, but I just, I just felt like for what this movie was, it's just. I understand why everybody who <laughs> I understand why people like recommended it yeah. for reaction yeah. because it's as much WTF as I've ever seen, but 2.5. Yeah. All right. Well, there you go. There, there's <laughs> Midsummer for you guys. So for Appleton Oak, Mason Quinn, I'm of course the answer. Good night, pals.